Hey, 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 what's up you guys? Jay once again with another tutorial video. Oh man, I'm kind of excited and kind of not. I don't know why. I want to make this video short. Um, hopefully I can keep this under 10 minutes. We're going to try. Let's give myself a challenge and keep this under 10 minutes. Okay, what I want to do, I want to talk up, I want to show you a new feature that I was super excited about. I waited for a while, but I had to do it. I am now using, if I can get my buttons right, the new Mac, um, Mac, Mo, uh, Mac OS Mojave. Finally, I was going to wait for a while just until some updates come out because as you know, when you're the first and when it comes to this software, sometimes you have to go through the bugs and wait for an update. You'll be the one, you know, tweeting and complaining about the issue that you're having with the software until the next update comes out. So I didn't want to, but there was a feature in it that I needed that I really, really had to have. So that's why I downloaded it. And that feature was continuity. Uh, by the way, I got everything preset so that I can keep this, this video real, real quick. Continuity was the ability for me to sync up my iOS device with my computer. So that way I can do these handoff things. Now I tried it in the other versions and I just uh, had headaches. So it wasn't as simple as it seems as what <laughs> Apple is saying. Continuity camera, you shoot it on the iPhone, you see it on the Mac. It's not that simple. <laughs> you have to actually work to get some of these things to some of these things to work. Now I'll come back to that page and I'll show you exactly how it's done. I finally set it up, so I'll come back and show you how it's done. But I wanna show you how um, I put, how, how it's done. And um, that way you won't, you won't have the same issues that I had when it comes to setting it up. So again, everything is preset. So uh, number one, you wanna make sure that you're using the latest version of everything. So I'm using Mojave, so you've already saw that. Now on my um, iPhone, oh, look at that right there. Well, let me quit playing, I got 10 minutes left. Um, okay, I'm gonna go ahead and open everything up. So you want to make sure that like actually using the latest version. Uh, of course, let me show you this. I'm using the latest version. Uh, uh, my iOS, is, everything is up to date. And uh, that's that. <laughs> okay, so there's four other things you want to want to make sure that you got, you got done. Um, you need to do in order to make sure that everything works. Uh, the first thing you want to make sure that both computers, your computer and your iOS device, whether it's your your um, iPhone or your your watch or your or even your um, iPad, you want to make sure that they have the exact same iCloud sync. Now I can show you how to do that in another video if you if you want me to. Um, in order to do that, I would like for you to subscribe to my channel. Just go to my channel and uh, you know I want you to click click that subscribe button right there, and then make sure you click on the. Uh, the little bell just to get notifications and I can send you all type of cool stuff that I'm going to be doing in some future videos. So be sure to subscribe to my channel. I appreciate that comment. And, uh, if you need me to show you how to set up your, or sync your, sync your devices together. Uh, so once you do that, um, there's four other things you need to do to make sure everything is synced. Well, three other things you want to make sure you make sure you have your Bluetooth. Uh, so in your, on your, on your computer, you go down to system preferences, you click on Bluetooth, and you just make sure that your Bluetooth is on. I turned it off first and then turned it back on. Another thing that I would recommend you do uh, to get to Bluetooth a lot faster is to click on this show Bluetooth menu bar in your settings. That way you can always see it here up at the top. You can, you can check it, make sure it's turned on and off there. Um, just thought you should do that. I do it. <laughs> okay, now you want to make sure your Bluetooth is set on your iOS device. Easy to do that. You just swipe up and just make sure your Bluetooth is on. By the way, make sure your Wi-Fi is on. That's the second. That's the third thing. So Wi-Fi is on, and you should have Wi-Fi. If you're watching this video from your computer, you should have Wi-Fi <laughs> on. So make sure your Wi-Fi is on here. All right, and um, the final thing, you just want to make sure your handoff is turned on. So to do that on your computer, you go up here to system, uh, Apple System Preferences. You want to go to General, 
and you want to go all the way down to allow handoff between this Mac and your iCloud device. So click that off. And then on your iOS device, you want to do that. You go to settings. You go down to general. And you see where it says handoff under airdrop. You make sure that's on. I turned it off and then I turned it on. That's what I did just to show you how it works. All right. Now everything is synced. So final thing. Now let's test this thing out. All right. We're going to test it out. You know, they were saying <laughs> over here. I laugh when I, when I see this again, how it, it, it says something that is just, I don't know. It's just, it's just funny to me how I love how Apple make things really, really simple. And then they're not that simple. So, um, you know, so I'm going to go here to, <laughs> I got to go read this again. It's just funny to me. I have to read it. Hopefully I haven't duped my minutes. Uh, but the continuity says, you know, shoot it on the iPhone, see it on Mac. But yeah, what you really need to do, let's, let's get started. It says scan a document or take a picture, something new about your iPhone instantly appears on your Mac. For example, pages, uh, choose insert, import from iPhone and then take a photo. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna go down to pages. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Here's pages. I'm gonna click on pages. Uh, I'm gonna hit a new document. And we're gonna go here. Uh, we'll do a school report. How about that? Okay, now I'm going to, since you gotta go up to here, hit insert, and then import from iPhone, hit take photo. Okay, so now, my phone, let me go to here. I have to move stuff out of the way so you can actually see it. My phone is on, so I'm gonna take a picture of my microphone and boom, click the picture and you click use photo. Boom, now it's in my document. Now that's pretty cool. So it actually works. So that's the first one. Uh, another thing, uh, of course, in continuity you can do, I'm not gonna say that, I'm gonna delete that. Um, uh, let's say you can, okay. Another thing in, that you can do, well, I'll do that, is to, um, I just want to show you another one, like Safari. Uh, this actually shows you how the continuity works. So if I launch Safari on my iPhone, and then I wanted to say I'm gonna go into sports, love sports, I'm a sports guy, and I wanna continue doing that, can you watching that on my uh, on my computer? You just go down here, and you're gonna see that little button here in Safari. It's gonna show the continuity. Click on that, and I'm actually watching. I'm actually seeing the same. Uh, it continues on from there. For some reason, it don't look the exact same, right? Am I right or am I right? Because you know those are two different things. Let me click on the Rockets Club and see an update there. I'm gonna get out of here for a minute. Let me kind of search them and scroll down. Let me just go into something different. All right, let's go to, I don't know, I'm trying to find some content. Um, Kyle Hendricks is an SB Nation. Now I wonder if it's gonna continue <laughs> continuity here. SB Nation, let's see. All right. Well, there you have it. Continuity. So, you guys, um, that's how it works. If you have any comments or questions, uh, be sure to just hit me up and I'll um, see if I can answer anything and help you guys out uh, with continuity. Uh, appreciate you guys watching. I'm not for sure if it's under 10 minutes. I don't have my clock, but I appreciate it. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.